friends you are highly welcome to bless Biafra network here in this network we talk about Biafrans Nigerians and the world at large in essence how Biafrans has been suffering so much in the hand of the Nigerian Janjawi government trying to get their way deserved nation called Biafra which existed so many years ago before the British came and destroy it all and here again this channel we also talk about Nigerian government who has been busy killing innocent Biafrans openly and secretly for no reason only because they say they want their own country in a peaceful agitation also in a peaceful manner and they have done so but Nigerian government has continuously killing them and the British government are there watching as if nothing is happening this is what we do not like and this is what we do not accept that is why we talk about these things and that is what you have to discuss so please let us go straight to the news of the day now the headline says Ambazonia's refugee camp located in Ogoja Biafra land indicates that Apple's peaceful agitation option remain the best approach in detail Ambrosania numbering over 200,000 from Trobo, Southern Cameroon presently settled in Adagong community in a Goja local government area of Cross River State, Biafra land. As refugees, they have been in this location for safety and security for the past 12 months. They have been there through instrumentality of the Nigerian government and the United Nations High Commission for Refugees. An estimated landscape over 400 hectares belonging to indigenous land owners of Adagon and Ndoka, both in Angoja local government area, was given out for their settlement. On investigation by Family Writers Press International, a lot of useful information we are gathered regarding this refugee camping project. The portion of land given out followed an agreement reached with the traditional rulers of the both Ndok and Adogon autonomous communities. Our correspondent reliable, reliable confirmed the signatory documents legalizing the said agreement of the indigenous land owners it to the reliance and courage of fwp correspondent to take a practical tour of the ambazonian refugee camp to ascertain both the affairs management of settled large ambazonian population from southern Cameroon. Interviews conducted with few of the refugees clearly reviewed their plight, they expressed concern over the dehumanizing living condition and misery which they were subjected to as a people in the land of the Cameroonian soldiers. They regretted engaging in all ill prepared armed struggle in the agitation for independence which unfortunately has claimed the life of over tens of thousands of Ambazonians. Families have been displaced resulting in the 
colossal destruction of Satan Cameroon. The refugees maintain that President Paul Bia blatantly disrespected the rule of law which has precipitated the gross abuse of international law guiding human rights. The worst of it all that has happened to us is our e preparedness for armed agitation through the use of guns and bullets against a well-equipped Cameroonian military. We lack support from the international community. Only recently, the United Nations offered us opportunity as they identified just few of us as internally displaced persons, IDP. They gave us refuge within this part of the Goja Cross River State. Further investigation by Family Writers Press International on the Bazonians' experience from veritable ingredients in the education of IPO family members, in particular, and Bia France generally, that the adopted approach of the IPO leader Mazen Nande Kahlo in the Bia France restoration struggle remains the best option suitable in Black Africa. IPOB in his finest, most ferocious, ferocious diplomatic approach has recorded enormous success, success over ever to be known in self-deception effort in African history. It is therefore advisable that Biafran in entirety should continually exhibit total relentless support and loyalty to Mazi Nandi Kalo. Meanwhile, there lies quite a lot of lessons to learn from the mistake of other nations that are clamoring for freedom through violent means. Recall that hip hop has become phenomenal and the most peaceful enlightened grassroots indigenous agitators the world over. It has generated it have generated for itself. Generate it has generated for itself. This enviable status due to its unwavering, unwavering knowledge and, uh, and compliance with the United Nations laws guiding self-determination. It must also be stated here that Nigerian, Britain, and the widely global community should understand that if Biafran decide to explore the option of violence, the event of 1967 to 1970 in Nigeria will be a child's play, the Fulani oligarchy and all their complies can never foretell what will eventually befall them. The resolve of IPO must not ever undermined by anyone. This particular write-up is coming from Eguato Chooks, reporting for Family Writers Press International. Thank you so much, friends. For listening and may god bless you all so have a nice day if you have anything to say please drop your comment in the comment section and all of your questions will be answered thank you Si tout le monde en offrait plus pour Noël. Plus que quelques jours pour profiter de l'incroyable Noël des bouquets Canal Plus et du décodeur HD à 5000 francs au lieu de 10 000. Profitez des meilleurs programmes pour toute la famille pour passer les plus belles fêtes de fin d'année. La fête commence. Faire le plein d'amitié. On va avoir besoin de tous les copains. De douceur. Moi je pense, je vis cuisine. De magie. Vous allez illuminer le ciel. D'émotion. Et ce n'est pas fini. Ah oui. En janvier, vos super-héros débarquent sur vos écrans. Super. Ça a l'air chouette. 
Alors, n'attendez plus pour vous abonner. C'est beau ce que tu dis.